Welcome to Oro Prado, a city where every cobblestone tells a story, and the echoes of the past are felt at every turn. Have you ever wondered why this city is named Black Gold? Or how it became a symbol of resistance and pride for an entire nation? Join me as we delve into the heart of Brazil's Gold Rush era, exploring opulent Baroque architecture and uncovering tales of revolutionaries who dared to dream of independence. Watch till the end for an exclusive journey through the city's stunning churches, adorned with gold and tales of devotion. From the bustling Procaturidentes to the poignant Musu Dine Confidentia, we're uncovering the secrets of this UNESCO World Heritage Site. And as we wander through artisan markets and soak in panoramic views, we'll discover why Rio Preto is a treasure trove of history, culture, and breathtaking beauty. All that and more coming up as we reveal the magic of Rio Preto and inspire you to embark on your own adventure in this captivating city. Stay tuned! Did you know that Oro Preto means black gold in Portuguese? This name is a nod to the city's rich history during the Gold Rush era when it was the center of gold mining and trade. The city was so prosperous that it was once the most populated city in Latin America, with half of its inhabitants being African slaves brought in to work in the mines. Today, the gold may be gone, but the wealth and opulence of that era are still evident in the city's stunning Baroque architecture and art. Oro Preto has always been a city of rebels and revolutionaries, it played a crucial role in Brazil's fight for independence, being the birthplace of the Inconfidentia Minera, a revolutionary movement that sought to establish a Brazilian republic free from Portuguese rule. Although the movement was ultimately quashed and its leader, Tiradentes, was executed, the city remains a symbol of resistance and pride for Brazilians. Let's start our adventure at the heart of Oro Preto, Procaturidentes. This bustling square is named after the revolutionary leader Tiradentes and is surrounded by historic buildings, charming cafes, and artisan shops. Take a moment to admire the monument commemorating Tiradentes and soak in the vibrant atmosphere of the square. Next, make your way to the Muzu Dine Confidentia, housed in a stunning Baroque building. This museum is dedicated to the Inconfidentia Minera and its leader, Tiradentes. Inside, you'll find artifacts, documents, and a tomb dedicated to the revolutionary hero. It's a poignant reminder of the city's rebellious past and a must-visit for history buffs. Oro Preto is famous for its Baroque churches, and you simply can't leave without visiting at least a few of them. The Church of São Francisco de Assis, designed by Elijah Dinho, is an absolute masterpiece with its intricate carvings and stunning artwork. Don't forget to also check out the Agrayan Asa Senhora do Rosario, built by African slaves and the Agraya Mate Ristinas Asenhora du Piler, which contains the second largest amount of gold of any church in Brazil. As you wander through the city, 
you'll come across numerous hand-to-craft markets where local artisans sell their wares. This is the perfect opportunity to pick up a unique souvenir, such as a hand-carved stone or a piece of local artwork. It's also a great way to support the local economy and take a piece of Oro Prado home with you. Finally, make sure to take the time to simply soak in the views. Oro Prado is set in a stunning landscape with lush green hills surrounding the city. Climb up to one of the many viewpoints, such as the Agreia di São Francisco di Paula, and take in the panoramic views of the city below. It's the perfect way to end your day in Oro Prado. And there you have it, my friends, a whirlwind tour of the magical city of Oro Prado. From its rich history and stunning architecture to its vibrant culture and breathtaking views, this city has something for everyone. I hope you've enjoyed exploring Oro Prado with me, and I hope it's inspired you to add this incredible destination to your travel bucket list. Until next time, keep exploring and keep adventuring. Oro Prado awaits.